Hello everybody, Swift here again with another Backpack Hero run and today we're gonna be doing the buff run, the, the nunchucks run but this time we're gonna min-max the nunchucks run we're gonna go and also pick up the relic that fits we're gonna be a full-on gymnast powerhouse or something like that in general I was reading a couple of comments to see uh, different ideas, opinions, etc and a bunch of people uh, suggested how to use the dumbbell and also... <clears throat> Uh, and also uh, some other things, <laughs> like how to use the club with spikes, which I don't have right now. Uh, anyway, for now we're gonna go with the nunchucks. Now this thing gains damage for every empty slot around it, as you see, adjacent specifically. But if you fail the requirement, gaining plus damage with the adjacent ones, and actually put things adjacent to it, then you will actually lose life every time you use it. Um, so yeah, that's what it pretty much does. I don't really need the lucky ring, I just need money. Although I would like the lucky ring. I'm okay with the bandages too, healing us. You know what, let's keep the lucky ring for a moment. And uh, I can also take like a couple of regen, maybe a regen. Uh, let's go to the double slime fight. Let's use the regen because there is no reason not to. We will lose a couple of, a bit of life here, but not enough so that the regen and this thing cannot heal us back up easy enough. Now we get one more level here. So this is fully decked out power level wise. And then... Uh, Maybe like two down here and one over here. So we have a bit of room for uh, things, you know, because we need a couple of things here and there. <clears throat> we need defense, maybe. We need damage. What is this? The rock moves for until stop. Does your damage challenge. You know what? We're going to use this for one fight. Here, we're going to have it like this and then use it. So doot, doot, doot. Something like that's what's going to happen. So, um, yeah, these are irrelevant right now. We will not really lose life. I'm just going to use this in the next fight. Is one? Is there a key door? There is a key door. Might as well pick this up. I might as well pick up the healing for when I need it. And uh, yeah, let's go to the key door. Throw this away. And let's go get a free win against the double slime fight. Okay, in case you have never seen what the rocket does, moves run until stopped. When I destroy, deals uh, zero damage. But when finishes moving, it gets destroyed. And when it moves, plus 10 damage. So it's going to be like... Doot, doot. That went a lot faster than what I was expecting. I guess because I have very fast um, yeah, speed on that. Let's go here. Let's also go more lucky rings. Why more lucky rings? Nobody knows. Why I'm going more lucky rings? Let's eat food. Let's assassinate the bank line first. Look at this. We're doing 20 damage per pop, man. We are completely busted. I found fishwood. We could go fishwood build, but it's a bit too late. Let's go here. Rat wolf. Imagine if both of these are rage generating. Like, just imagine. Just imagine how awesome it would be. 20 damage per attack, man. 20 damage per attack right away. Very powerful. It is restrictive, obviously, but still, the power is there. And when the power is there, then everybody's happy. Let's so let's get a little cube. Let's get a little cube. Not sure if cubes are a good idea in general in this game, but uh, yeah, we got our thing going. Uh, one more, one more lucky ring, and uh, this becomes the OP nunchucks of the universe, something like that. When I have so many around us, let's go rage. No, I can go weapon. Why not? Ooh, ooh. Can we use one time? Adds great luck on kill. Hmm. Let's throw this away and get this. Actually, I don't even need the healing right now. Let's see if I can get one. Let's see if I can get a lucky kill. Or I can just sell it, you know. Just selling it is also choice. Let's uh, get a bunch of things here to all to sell them all. Literally uh, right now. Because we want the money. Okay, here you go. Yours. And uh, I also don't need the healing, honestly. Ooh, we found poison on use. Meh. Not really that useful. You know what this would be useful with? Can be used one time each turn. This can this could be useful with I know exactly with what this could be useful. You know what? I'm gonna pick this up. No, it's gonna cost 20. Forget it. Forget it. Th that thing is gonna be would be useful with um with uh, the the club thing. You know, the zero cost club. People have been telling me to use it. Uh, I, I'm I'm gonna try to find a couple of so I'm I right now I have three runs in mind. This one the zero cost wand, uh, not wand, the zero cost club, and then the a, a, a multiple wand build with cotton. So as you understand, right now I'm trying to chase down relics that I'm not using that often pretty much. Explode. Explode. Jean, let's go here. How much damage does this do? We don't know. Is there any chance that this does six? Yes. Boom, let's see. Legendaries only. Well, I guess nothing changed, honestly. 20 damage. <laughs> Uh, great luck, man. Great luck. Carries you through this game. Uh-oh. I'm kidding. I do 60 damage per turn anyway. Aha. I'm so powerful. You cannot stop me. Theoretically, I could equip, uh, you know, something for defense. Well, theoretically, I can. 
because I'm using this three times, so my having defense, I would pretty much just not take damage, but I would also do less, and that's the main issue. Doing less is the issue, not doing more. I can get a couple of consumables. Uh, let's go fighting, there was no key anywhere. <coughs> Brigade Muscat! Explosion, make them weaker, defense, bye, 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 bye. And the defense actually was important, I mean not that much, because I also have the bandages. Crimson energy is completely busted as we're gonna have like 50 spots or closed anyway. Ho 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 ho. That's extremely lucky. Uh, uh, Crimson, this is one of the builds where Crimson energy is actually extremely good at. So I'm happy. Also, I was reading a couple of comments saying that they were extremely glad that I was not keeping the Crimson energy last run I did. Because I'm, I'm trying to force Crimson energy very often whenever I get the chance. And I guess today it's a, it's a lucky day. Let's go. Let's go fighting. I'm gonna use the food obviously before the macaronis start happening. Not that it really matters. Let's uh, jumble around and hope for my luck to improve. So we get the dumbbell. Okay, we got this guy. So I was expecting a B, but it's not a B. This guy's obviously dead right away. Let's see what we get. Three spaces. Uh, it doesn't really matter, but I would say let's go towards the left. In general, having a bunch of lower elevations instead of going this way, uh, in general, it's better to go sideways, uh, like a pyramid, because if you want to have a bunch of helmets, you want them to be at the highest point possible, all of them. And if I do this, for example, the only highest point that exists is this line. While by doing something like this, for example, you can have one highest point here and one highest point there. But I don't want to <laughs> do something with the hand. We literally got what I wanted, the barrel. The barrel. All weapons get this effect applied. When an adjacent item is present, this item gets disabled. Otherwise, it gets double damage. So now this does double damage. Now this does 40 per smack. And now the next thing I want is energy, pretty much. Oh, let's go, Pearl. That's really good. This also gets multiplied by the double damage, by the way. And uh, this is uh, completely useless, as it literally does not work. And this also does not work anymore. So this is also pretty much useless. Uh, the energy I'm going to get, I'm going to use it right away at the start of the next fight. And I think we're good to go. I think we're good to go. I'm sure for anybody that wanted me. I could have picked up the Peridot actually just to sell it on the shop. I should have. I should have. I'm not even sure if it's called the uh, Peridot. Just randomly said the name. Here we go. Power up. How much is this? 48 damage. Nice. As I said, this does multiply. Uh, adjacent weapons get plus one healing. Would be nice. This would be even better with a club hammer thing. Uh, energy. Why not? And let's go next fight. Shop. I don't think I need the shop. Rage. Nope. I hate you. I hate you, Vance. Oh, by the way, I have a joke I have a joke prepared for a specific event. If no, oh, we almost lost life. Oh, I cannot even lose life. I'm forced to actually either be able to use it or not able to use it at all. Oh, I got another lucky ring. Now what is this? Deal 25 damage when you get hit. Yeah, we're gonna go with this here and spot. Oh no no no, this is a weapon. No 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 no. Stay away from that thing. <laughs> let's uh let's go here. Imagine game going in a battle with a weapon. You're dead. Two tapped, two tapped, nice. I lose a bit of life here. I obviously would enjoy gaining some kind of lifesteal. Actually, Vampirism is the only thing that could have... Ooh, plus two damage, wow. Just wow, this is useless now. Let's go with plus two damage on the sideways. Now this does 52. 52? I'm a, I'm a strong boy. That's why I wanted to go with this thing. Dumbbell, let's go. Two shining people. Uh, you know, miss, dead. <laughs> and the other one's also dead. And now I just need energy. Ooh, we even found a longbow again. Man, the power of the lucky rings. Power of the scouts code. Let's take this. Let's take this. Let's take this. We're going towards the shop. Here you go. Yours. Uh, no, yours and yours. Let's put these back in. Uh, what did we find? A teddy bear sword, an electric arrow for 10. Nope. I, I just want to buy more crimson energies. If you can sell us more crimson energies, it would be a delight. Let's see what we get. Trash. I've never accepted this guy's gamble. Could have bought a key for the max health. Yeah, that was a key. Yeah, luck as luck would have it, and also the the arrow. I'm so happy that there are a couple of builds that might not be completely busted, but you can like I haven't ever done run with them, like uh, like this one. I I've never done the I did the nunchuck run, but I didn't do a nunchuck plus barrel run, barbell, and I don't know why I never realized that these combo together well. And the other things too, like I haven't done. I, I'm talking about relics. I have not done a barbell run. I have not done. Uh, what is the other one called? What is the other one called? Come on. The cotton one. I haven't done a cotton one. And I also have done like one or maybe two clock runs. 
Three spaces. Let's continue going towards the right. The more away we get from this thing, the less of a chance we're going to make a mistake. Oh, I found a rogue's helmet. Let's take that. Very high chance I'm going to forget to use it once again. But if I forget it, then it is what it is. And if I don't forget it, then oh, we get a bunch of defense. <laughs> we avoid getting hit. Okay, we assassinate those guys in the back. Then we're going to go like, dodge. You see, I remember it. I remember it. Ooh, literally just picked it up. Literally just remembered. Ooh, we found Doru here. Still trash. Still trash. It either needs to become a two cost, even at the expense of losing a bit of its damage per turn, or something has to happen with it. I don't know. Maybe if it gets per turn 20 damage, then maybe it's good. Because the problem with that thing is that after you use it, you cannot defend. No blacksmith rage. Yes. Yes. Also, Blacksmith Poison makes the other build go round. I mean, I still have not done the other build. But, um, yeah. Dodge. The other build being the... Um, what is it called? Uh, the, 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 the other build. <laughs> you know. Let's go Consumables. Also, region. Why not? Uh, let's see. Vent Rage. No. A book. Uh, was there a key anywhere? Man, I, I missed like two good things. Deep Cave Fight. 11 minutes, by the way. We're blasting through here. Blasting through. Not sure how much we're gonna survive, though. But we are blasting through. That's for sure. <laughs> Look at this. This guy's toast. He's not even gonna play once. Wow. He he will play once. Okay. And even the summon is not gonna play. Wow. Come on. Give me energy. Uh, clock is also doable. But no, we're gonna go energy. Energy is literally gonna give us another 52 damage on top of whatever I'm already doing. This is gonna add... Uh, this is going to add 2, 4, 6, and 8 damage to my attacks. Because whatever it adds, it gets multiplied by 2. Why the 5th attack is just plus 52 damage? Yeah, I'm going to go with another energy. So let me reroll here. Okay, I'm back. And I realize that energy is not the issue right now. I decided to actually go for the Cleansing Flame that I happened to pick up. Uh, I mean, this happened to drop literally next fight. So uh, let's actually pick up the Cleansing Flame. Because once again, if the final boss is the Spike Boss, we will not be able to actually beat him. Uh, as I need to attack him as often as possible. And yeah, even if I do 250 damage per turn, taking 1, 2, 3, pl 1, plus 2, plus 3, plus 4, plus 5 spikes, plus his attack is going to be like 40 damage per turn. And within two turns, I will be dead. So, oh, what? This is unbelievable that we get the most busted item in the game in a build that literally cannot really use it. Right? 52 damage. Wait, does it actually work? No, it doesn't. But it also doesn't count as an item next... Wait a minute. Wait, it oh, it does work. <sighs> oh, wait, wait. The duct tape for this thing works as an extension. 52 damage. Oh, because these... The, yeah, because uh, these are spots that it already covers. But if I, for example, put it here... Like, if I somehow do this... This can go here, for example. Okay, 52 damage. And here... 56 damage. Nice! Okay, but now whatever I put next to it is gonna hurt us. Um, well, guess what's gonna go? <laughs> guess what's gonna go? A couple of lucky rings is what's gonna go. It is what it is. I still want to keep the region, though. Uh, I will keep these because I can use this. But now I do more damage, you know? 56. Now it's a super... It's a super nunchuck. Just that that 6 damage might do a difference. You never know, man. When adjacent weapon is used, add 1 HP. Uh, well, that's useless when the uh, weapon also uh, hits us. And let's not forget that because I gain rage, the hurt thing actually multiplies too. So I need to be very careful about that. Uh, I think we're good here. I think we're good here. Two consumables to throw away. They're healing in any case. Definitely better than lucky ranks. I mean, I don't, I don't really need lucky ranks. It's not like I'm chasing anything down. Although the fact that we got like a duct tape. Insane. Insane. Let's go snake and fire gecko. Use these right away. And now we're ready for 56 damage maps. Boom. Dead. Boom. Dead. Nice. Another one of these, pretty useless. I would say we go for the energy. The key, obviously, not only not you needed. I mean, it is needed back there, but until we get there, it's going to be a year. Let's first fight this in case we want to open up the key door next. Use these right away, obviously, and assassinate. <laughs> Man, I really enjoy the power we are having. And there is no key here and pretty much nothing else I really care about. Maybe key is going to be here. Okay, not. We found a letter that I can use to pass through. To do more damage, but I don't think I really need it. This is a weapon. I need to really pay attention to these. Those things are weapons. And I need to make sure I'm never going to pick anything up. Because the moment I use a consumable, they will transform into weapons. And then they're going to disable my... No what? Are you kidding me right now? And now duct tape? 
Uh, obviously, Archangel Arm is insane. Man, I found Archangel Arm. Well, doesn't matter. Uh, let's go another duct tape. But this time, throw this out too. Uh, I need room. I need room. This is okay here. This is not. This is double space, right? Yeah, this is double space. Well, I cannot put it here. I can... I... Well, first of all, uh, this is out. Okay, this goes here. I have... Is there any room anywhere? There is no room anywhere. Like, there is... Oh, there is one room here. And right now, this is disabled. Because, yeah, the way this is going. Uh, but you know what? I can do something like this. Oh, well, that's also impossible. I can do this. Also not possible. Uh... <laughs> I can do this. Also not possible. All of these are not possible. The only possible spot is this corner. So I need to get a level. I need to get a level right now. This needs to be buffed still. This corner is also not possible. All of these corners. This is literally the only possible corner. Yeah. Okay, when I get a level, we will fix it. But for now, we're going with what we have. I obviously want as much damage at this on this as possible. I mean, this is the buff build. We go with damage only. Damage, damage, and once again, damage. Oh no, I'm gonna lose a bit of life. Who cares? Come on, give me non-curse. Yeah, regen. Okay, uh, you can put it here. And then I can be like, use this, and you're dead. You're dead. And I got a level. Nice. As far away from this thing as possible. I would say something like this. And maybe here. Actually, does this need to be the, in the highest spot possible? I'm not sure if it does. I can put this not here. Hmm. If I put the ring here, it's only covering this one space. So I would say something like this, and maybe down here in the corner or something. Oh, now that I think about it, this space is actually only one specific spot that I can't even put an item in. That's how I should use the Crimson Ring. I put it here, and it hits this, and I would never ever put anything in this space anyway. Uh, the rest, I guess, is this corner is a good choice. Okay, let's take this away. Nice. It works now again. It works now again. It now works again. <laughs> this can be here too if it wants. Helmet to the right, get minus one block, can be used one time each combat. Okay, this this doesn't care. When it's space above this, then this gets mine. Okay, it does care. Why though? Isn't this a weapon too? Yeah, but I can use it. And I think we're good to go. Is there a key? No. Let's go. Let's go. What a what a what a nice what a nice little build. I love it. I love it. Now I'm doing 60 damage. By the way, the fact that I got two tuck tapes. Is insane. On its own. Okay, we will take a bunch of damage here. Oh, no! Ah, Safety had one job, man. One job. Use the stupid drogs mask. Let's go here. So I heal. Might as well have the poison over there. Ah. <laughs> Let's have this here, this there. Nice, now all of these heal. Time to start healing. Yep, I don't have any more room. Uh, this is max life, for sure. I don't care. Triple fire gecko fight. Let's go double all. Here, here. Smack, 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 smack. And dodge. Ooh. Imagine the concept. <laughs> Let's go lightning ring. Heal, heal. Whoops. Yeah, heal and lose the run. I think we're good here. This could be done with lightning ring too. <laughs> Obviously not. Uh, but it could. I mean, I, I could have a barrel a lightning ring run. I think. I'm not sure. Let's go here. Uh, I'm gonna keep the heals as they heal more than what damage is incoming. This is dead. This is dead. And if he doesn't give us the spike curse, it's also gonna be dead. And he gives us the ra rage curse, which literally doesn't matter. Eat here. Now I'm for life. Okay, I found energy. Why not? I can have the healing corner here. Uh, money? I don't really need money. Honestly, I don't really need money. Yes, money is useful, don't get me wrong, but... Yeah, I mean, 38 is enough. It's not like I need anything in this build. If I did need something in this build, then obviously I would take a couple of things, but nah, I don't. Also, I should have bought a bunch of things just to sell them. Bye, bye, bye. Uh, another Archangel Armor. I could have gone with two Archangel Armors, but where would I fit them? I guess one here, and one here. Without the, the duct tapes. Something like that. Something like that could have happened. Rage gain? No. Different items, same rarity. Useless. 
Let's go. Let's actually go shopping after I pick up a couple. No, 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 no. Why is this here? Why is that there? I obviously will be able to not take damage, but wow. A misclick. A misclick. Let's go shop. Uncommon and common, I guess. Actually, I want one energy for the next fight. Talk to me here, here. Let's put this there. Oh. I got a sneeze. I'm dying. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I could have this book to power up diagonals. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go double one fight. Pretty simple fight. Dodge. Yep, no damage taken. Man, my nunchucks are doing 64 damage. This is insane. This is insane and also extremely fast, man. 20 minutes and we're at the final boss already. Speed race time. Speed race? Now this is speed racing. <laughs> speed running. Speed running. I'm spamming here to improve my luck. I believe that by spamming I will be a bit more lucky. And we got the easy boss. Very nice. Nice, nice, nice. We're gonna dodge the 23 hit attack incoming. Okay, let's try again. Ooh. Uh, first of all, let's block the damage. Okay, 8 damage is manageable. If I don't take another 20 on top of that. And this guy is one more hit away, and we win. We lost a lot of life, but it's okay. Come on, give me energy. Okay, level first, I guess. Uh, obviously, this is okay, but the rest is not. And I guess I can go two spaces here. Actually, I can go two spaces here, so I surround this thing with a bunch of consumables to be able to heal if I need to. Come on. Okay, I didn't find it. I found this. All weapon with this. On Jason or Diagonal Armor Shield is present. The sign gets disabled. Well, this gets plus six damage. So this is plus six damage, straight up. No, it does 72. But I still believe one more energy is better. Because 72 times four is... Uh, 280 something, maybe almost 300, while uh, 60 times 5 is 300 on the dot. And also, I can spread it out better, more easily. So, uh, let's reroll here until I find energy. Okay, and we are back. I got the windmill, so let's put it here. I'm not sure if this is the exact layout I opened up previously, but I just went faster and faster throughout the restarts. So yeah, these are the spots we have open now. Uh, pretty much these three, honestly speaking. I guess I can have this here and then uh, have this cross maneuver be for healing. Anyway, off to the endless mode. Off to the endless mode. Man, this is going to be like a 3D minute video that I lose. But um, yeah, I mean, this is a pretty quick run, man. I have to say. That's what happens when you, every smack is like 60 damage. Uh, one haste. Not really that useful. I can have this here to chill. There isn't even a downside on having it here. And uh, yeah, let's go. Haste is useless as I don't generate shield or defense at all. One more energy. Really nice. Really nice. Okay, so right now I'm doing 60 damage per smack and I'm smacking five times. That means I'm doing 300 damage. Also get energy, even more. I can use it whenever I want. So people are telling me to go with a cauldron run. That's also a thing that exists, but I believe it's very trash. If you can get two cold ones, you can have them in a layout like one here and one here, like a zigzag layout. And they say that they generate a potion on their line. And when a potion is used and consumable is destroyed in their row, then um, you uh, get it back. So, for example, the cold one on this spot is going to generate an item in this spot. And then you use the item from this spot to um, give this I the cold one up here the cooldown. And then you use this to generate something here. You use the item here. Then you can use this cold one. Something like that is the whole idea. But, uh, like, I was explaining it as fast as possible, right? Imagine that gameplay-wise. Like, it takes so long to take off. Like, you, you have to just press this button here, then press that button there, then choose where to put the item and then use the item, then the item pops, then you have to use the other cold drawn. <laughs> it's it's just too much work. Too much work for a very small payout. Oh, we found the god item, by the way. We found the Berserkers Club I was talking about. This item here has a build, a unique build that I want to create, but it's uncommon, so it will be a bit harder for me to actually set up the run specifically, but I, I will do it. I will do it. Not today, but it will happen. Now somebody else steals my idea. Wink, wink. Wink, wink. Somebody wants to steal my idea. Wink, wink. <laughs> you know what? If you want, just comment down below and tell me about it. If you're like some kind of content creator. Yes, Sift. 
I will actually do the run you suggested. Muhahahaha. <laughs> also add the muhahahaha <laughs> so that it's all fun and games instead of, you know, being literally. <laughs> I'm kidding, by the way. I'm having fun. It doesn't matter if somebody else do, does my ideas. At the end of the day, do you know who else can do my ideas? I. <laughs> I can do my ideas. So if, if somebody, I mean, does the run, I can also do the run. It's not like, oh, if somebody does it, then somebody else comes in and uh, slaps you with a log. Uh, uh, you know, a lawsuit or something. No, you just play the game and go on with your life. Let's go onwards. Okay, 300 life is barely enough. Two life on the dot. Wait a minute, what? Wait, how? Does this thing scale damage? Diamond, pearl, ruby. Wait, why does this do 65? Why does this thing do 65? No, now it does 60. I have range gain. I have rage gain. Oh, plus two damage, which means plus four damage. <laughs> I'm more powerful than ever. I just need vampirism. Give me rage. Nope, you're trash. Uh, two times the same gold bow. I did not know that you can do that. I'm not even going to spin once. I don't want to risk the curse. I'm still lacking a bunch of life. Uh, well, life lag is going to kick in here and we're going to get hit very heavily. And we're going to dodge at least one of those two attacks. Ugh. Okay, maybe I should be rushing the main boss. Yeah, I, I made myself lose a bunch of life because of my... Uh, greed. Greed. Because of my greed, we lost a lot of life here. Uh, let's go red slime fight. We're, we're slowly having a problem. Slowly but surely, problems are arising. Let's dodge that attack. Practically now this is gonna regen and this is gonna get smacked. Yep, very nice. Very quick. Ooh, adjacent. Well, guess what? Adjacency is not something I can actually use. So that is useless. Yep, that is actually useless. I'm so sad about the fact that that's true. Let's take this though for healing. Five energy. I wanted vampirism ring. And what did I get? Healing ring. Completely useless and unusable. Is useless superseding unusable? Or is unusable above uselessness? <laughs> Let's go on. Let's hope this guy gives us the plus five damage thing. Here you go. I heal, I heal. I smack you as much as I can. I will take the 15, and I also will take the next hit, and I'm going to use the dodge for his biggest hit. The last one. The last one is going to be, by definition, his biggest hit. Obviously, this is a speed run. We try to out-DPS him. Here, I'm going to use the dodge for the biggest hit, as I said, 22. And now we get him. Now we get him. He get got. Okay, so now the problem is that what do I want? I want the plus 5, plus 6, plus 5 damage. Yeah, I'm going to reroll again. And I'm back. And uh, the choices were the clock. Okay, because I attack five times. So this gives me one plus two plus four plus six plus ten damage. Or the plus six damage as long as there is no armor or adjacent or diagonal or whatnot. I decided to go for this. Because after five attacks, like from the second turn onwards, this is going to outscale it. I'm not sure if it's the right choice, honestly speaking. But at least it's, uh, it leaves one more space. Because the other one is double spacer. So I can at least have consumables here to use. Not that I would not put consumables here and use them. But whatever. Let's go with this. I don't want to take like a thousand years re-rolling. It's, uh, it's starting to become a bit tiring. I mean, you are not seeing it, but yeah, on, on, on my side of things, it's not really fun to restart every single turn. Uh, I just realized something. I need to reorganize just a bit. Let's have these like here, like this. Okay, these are the power items. And these are the use, them, use the consumable items. items. <laughs> these are the use the consumable items. Items. <laughs> I'm, I'm good at explaining things, yo. So this is like the permanent area over there. Pretty much. Pretty much. We'll start healing here. Will I survive? Who knows? Who knows? We're already fighting the bat. It's doing 3d2 damage. So if I don't kill it right now, dodge works on bleed. So we're obviously gonna do the dodge. Almost made a huge mistake there. Almost made a huge mistake. Found a piggy bank. Uh, well, we're gonna go with more healing, I would say. And more healing. I mean, it's just 5 health. You know what? Not even this. I'm gonna even use the herb. You know what? All of them. All of them. 15 health. 15 health is 15 health, man. It's important. Okay, we're gonna start smacking here. Because uh, the curse is a bit harder for me to use. Is that even true? You know what? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna take the damage. I'm gonna... Mm, yeah. I, I, I'm not allowed to take this curse. The one curse I'm not allowed to take. The spikes curse. It's gonna kill us. Let's throw it away. Uh, okay, I can obviously avoid the 28 damage. That's not an issue. Nice. 
And now we continue with smacking. Now we hope that this Chris is not the spike Chris again. Please give me rage or region or anything. Thank you. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. No way. We got the one Chris we can't really counter. End of turn gets destroyed. This thing has 20 life. I can't even... Ah, I don't have the dodge. That was a very big hit. I can't throw anything away. Oof. Oof. We take 15. There is no other choice. I need the healing. Uh, yeah, this is a weapon, so it cannot be next to each other. No, this is the only usable item. Oof. See so what we get? Rage? Nope. I hate you. Why do I even talk to her? I hate you. Blue slime, double fight. Okay, I think this is the end. This is the end. You know. Uh, start smacking the back line and hope the curse is not. I think this is the best play. Smack the back line. Hope the curse both times is not spikes. Or this thing. At this point, I'm forced to throw away. Actually, I'm not. I can take 16. Okay, now the back line is obviously dead. Please give me a curse that I can use, man. Rage. Spikes. Well, it's over. Uh, it's super over. We put this here and lose the healing. Because if I put it anywhere else and press it, he will gain 10 spikes and 10 spikes is lethal against us. Now we go smacking. We don't have spikes anymore. Oh, we're dead. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter here given the 10 spikes. It's over. I, I'm not sure if I made a mistake anywhere, but by the way, literally 20 life left. I'm not sure if I made a mistake anywhere, uh, but even if I did... We know for a fact that we would have died, right? I hope you guys realize that. E even if even if I had, for example, 25 or 30 more health because of some other mistake somewhere, we don't have defense. And literally, uh, we, we didn't even find any of the dangerous opponents. For example, if I fought one more bat, actually, yeah, if I fought one more bat without having the energy regen, we would have most likely taken a lot more damage. In general, uh, it was a dead run, but still it was a fun run and also a quick one. I was not expecting this to be a 3D minute run there we, where we are at floor 13 with no defenses, no util real utility other than damage, or other than our brute strength because we have a barbell. <laughs> I'm getting guys, I'm not good at trying to scream. And anyway, that is going to be it. Thanks for all the Patreon and the membership supporters. And if you enjoyed this and want to see more like this, drop a like, man. Helps out with the algorithm. It will also make it so that the algorithm shows you more of my stuff and also other people will also see a bunch of my footage you know so if you want to help the channel out and me and, and me in general then uh, yeah comment down below about it uh i mean drop a like anyway that is going to be it for today let's not do a huge outro on such a small video and yeah once again thanks for watching and see you guys around